When you think about who you are, what's the first thing that comes to mind? If you think of your name, that's not the whole story. You're more than just a name. So who are you, really? Most people's answers don't quite capture the full picture. Interestingly, if you just stay quiet without saying anything, you're actually on the right track. Here's the deal. We often describe ourselves based on things like our thoughts, beliefs, and life's challenges. For example, if I asked you to tell me about yourself, you might talk about your age, where you're from, or your job. But it's important to understand that you're more than these external labels. You're not just a job title, and you're not defined by tough times you've been through. Those things change, but your true self doesn't. It stays the same, unwavering. Let me explain this in simpler terms to help you grasp your real identity. Allow me to elaborate further so that you can gain a deeper understanding of your true identity. Let's think about a moment when you might feel anxious. Anxiety often means worrying about what's going to happen in the future. Your mind can make up all sorts of ideas and stories that make you feel stuck and unable to be yourself. But here's an important question to consider. Who is the one noticing this anxiety? It's you. You are the one who is aware of your anxiety. You are not the anxiety itself. In life, we all encounter moments of difficulty, pain, and suffering. It might be anxiety about the future, overthinking, or just the general stress of daily life. But there's a profound realization that can change how you perceive and navigate these challenges. Consider this. The one who is aware of suffering is not the same as the one who is experiencing it. In simpler terms, it's like having two parts of yourself. One part goes through the tough time, while the other part watches and understands what's happening. This awareness can be a powerful tool to detach from your suffering and see it from a higher, more objective perspective. Let's take overthinking as an example. When you catch yourself trapped in a cycle of endless thoughts, ask yourself, who is noticing this overthinking? This simple question shifts your focus from being entangled in thoughts to being the observer of those thoughts. It's like taking a step back to see the bigger picture. Before we finish this video, I'd like you to truly connect with your authentic self. This means realizing that you are not limited by your pain and suffering, and you are more than just a human being. At a deeper level, you're a part of something much greater, something profound. This understanding can transform how you approach life's experiences. It's like discovering a hidden power within yourself. You realize that you have the ability to shape your own reality. You can regain a sense of pure love, peace, joy, and confidence, even in the face of adversity. You're close to reconnecting with your real self. Take a moment to notice how you're aware of yourself watching this video. You don't need to actively think about this awareness. It's always there. It's like a constant presence in the background of your mind. Even when thoughts come and go, remember that you are also aware of those thoughts. This means that you are not just one person becoming aware of another person. You are, fundamentally, the awareness itself. This understanding can bring you closer to your inner self and provide a profound sense of your true identity. You go beyond being just an ordinary human. You're so much greater than that. Now, let's refocus on the music in the background. Instead of forming judgments or getting caught up in thoughts about it, fully engage with the experience of listening. Once you've established a sense of awareness about the music, let's take it a step further and become aware of your own awareness. This practice can help you connect with a deeper part of yourself and appreciate the present moment with heightened clarity. Shift your attention away from specific experiences and turn it towards your own awareness. Keep in mind that you can't fully grasp or understand this through thinking alone, so let go of trying to figure it out with your thoughts. You are not defined by your thoughts. The essential step is to become aware of something and then redirect your focus to the feeling of awareness itself. Spend some time in this state of awareness, and if your thoughts start to take over, gently bring your attention back to this state of awareness. This practice can help you connect with a deeper, more profound aspect of yourself. In moments of suffering, a powerful tool is to ask yourself, who is aware of this happening? 
But don't look for an answer in your thoughts. Instead, fully immerse yourself in becoming aware of your awareness. This is your true essence, your core being. It's essential to understand that you are not defined by the narrative of your life, your past or your mistakes. You are, at your core, pure consciousness, pure awareness. Any problem or challenge you face only exists because you are aware of it, but it doesn't define your fundamental self. Your true nature remains untouched by external circumstances because you are the observer of all that unfolds in your life. Importantly, this practice of self-awareness won't lead to a sense of disconnection or detachment. Instead, it's a return to your natural state of pure love, peace, joy, and self-assuredness. By recognizing your true self and acknowledging that you are the observer of your experiences, you can navigate life's ups and downs with greater serenity and resilience. Taking a moment to be aware of your own thoughts and emotions can have a profound impact on your well-being. When you do this, you start to realize that suffering and pain don't define who you truly are. This growing awareness makes it easier to let go of self-limiting beliefs and the things that hold you back in life. It's important to grasp that you are more than just an ordinary person. You are life itself, fully present in the here and now, and within you resides a remarkable inner strength. While it's challenging to put into words, this inner strength has the potential to bring about powerful transformations in your life. You can change because your current beliefs don't determine your essence. You have the power to change them. Your life story isn't set in stone. You can rewrite it. And those feelings of sadness or anxiety that you may experience don't define you either. You can become aware of them and learn to change how you respond to them. When you truly understand yourself, you become better at dealing with life's challenges. You realize that you have the power to control your own life. This essential truth empowers you to take charge of your life and rediscover feelings of pure love, peace, joy, and confidence. So, when you're going through tough times in your mind, simply remember to focus on your thoughts and awareness. If I asked you right now, who are you? How would you answer? This simple act of self-awareness can lead to significant positive changes in your life. I want to express my gratitude for staying with me till the very end. I hope I have not wasted your time. If you love what I'm doing, please consider sharing it with your loved ones and feel free to share your experiences to benefit others. I wish you a wonderful day.